Good evening from Yami B TV. Wishing you all well today. Hope your day's gone the best it possibly can. All the travelling around the country is killing me at the moment, but I'm getting on with it. And in fact, I'm loving it. They drained you out a little bit. A uh, couple of things I was thinking about today as well, about when you lose loved ones whilst you're behind the door. You know, I've suffered that same fate twice now. Uh, and the feelings were a bit different for both. Uh, one was my father, one was my cousin. And both of them brought um, different feelings around certain things. Um, but yeah, it's, it's, it's a really touchy subject. I mean, like if you ever wanted to give anybody a warning about not going to prison, about what it would feel like if you're behind a door when you lose your mum, your dad, and members of your family. Uh, I've seen some things that will really leave you heart wrenched forever. So, you know, I'll have to give you a reminder of that kind of stuff that you have to face. I was on my hands and knees once. Very difficult when you're faced, when you're behind the door and you've got a stranger coming to bring you the news that somebody's died. You know, I've seen grown men hang themselves, kill themselves, uh, end up in mental hospitals because of certain situations. Uh, for example, you know, like for one, uh, a man done something um, to harden criminals before and they couldn't find him and apparently they killed all his family and he was never the same again. Um, but it's like that. You know, in that life as well. In fact, I've seen it twice in life, you know, where people have to pay for people like me, you know, because you can't get hold of the criminals you want and they bring it to the family doorsteps, you know, and take it out on them. You know, it's something the old school villains and people like me, we never ever brought families into things, you know, to uh, for our mistakes or like if you had a separate uh, bit of beef or aggro with somebody, you know, you'd keep it. You know, between each other in that life, you know, you know, so you can't be bringing people's families into it. But the shock of being told your mum has died, and you know, I experienced that out here, which I was really grateful for. Actually, I was really over the moon because that was a real fear for me. And you know, it's only now that you know I understand what you were always telling me about the grieving process. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna come up tomorrow, and I'm I'm gonna do that one in the morning when I feel a little bit more revitalized. Um, what else? Yeah, Billy Moore soon as well. Yeah, good, good man, Bill. Big up Billy Moore. Yeah, we're going to sit down and have a chat with Bill about a number of things uh, that's coming as well. And um, what else? What else? What else? No, I think that's about it. So um, sending love. I'm okay. And um, hoping you're all all right. All right. I'll see you soon. Sending love.